Spider Sandwiches by Claire Friedman and Sue Hendra. Do come to tea with Max. He has a monster appetite. He eats such yucky, mucky food. His mealtimes are a fright. He loves to glug, slug milkshake through a stinky hosepipe straw. And as for beetle biscuits, he can always munch one more. For breakfast every morning, he chews toenailed scrambled eggs, then guzzles down a smoothie made from squidged grasshopper legs. He buys snacks on the internet from a far away as space. Spiky space ants, moon goo globs are all stuffed in his face. By lunchtime, Max is starving. Scrummy lice rice, I can't wait. He slurps it super fast before the lice crawl off his plate. He bought the monster's cookbook for some recipe ideas. The best was slime eel noodles served with hairy fried bat's ears. To pickled worms and squashed fly jam, Max beams. Hooray, yes please. He spreads them on his crackers, poo, with smelly fish eye cheese. So delicious, gurgles Max with a massive goo-filled grin. Cold, crunchy cockroach curry drip dribbling down his chin. Tadpole ice cream, snail trail sauce, things that squirm and slurp. They all mixed in his tummy. Look out, here comes a burp. <coughs> Rat's tail pizza, blue mould chips, bug burgers are a treat. But when it comes to tea time, there's just one thing he'll eat. Squidgy spider sandwiches, he shoves them in so fast. He eats their heads and sticky webs, but saves their legs for last. Max will eat up anything that oozes gunk and gloop. But even monsters gasp. No funks. When faced with... Green sprout soup. Oh.